Okay, here we are doing permutations and combinations. And we've got our cats, A, B, C, and D. And in this case over here, we're going to do a permutation with them. So we're taking three of them. One's going home with me, one's going to my niece's house, and one's going to have gumbo made of him. And so here, I'm going to squeeze on here, here are the different possibilities. So my, my goal is to get the number 24, because this is, really means how many different ways can I choose out of four, three things. And over here, I have four. So that's the difference. The combination, I'm just going to choose the three cats and put them in my car and take them home, and they'll all be my pet. So those, that's what I'm working from. And I want to do these side by side because we're going to compare the formulas. So notice I have highlighted here the only difference between these two formulas is this added little extra bit. Remember these are factorials. You can go back to a previous video and check out factorials and how to do them. So these are our two formulas. So using this formula, I'm going to do, this is 4 factorial over 4 minus 3 factorial, and I'm going to do these simultaneously so we can see the subtle differences. This is 4 factorial over 3 factorial, 4 minus 3 factorial. Okay, so there's my difference. There's the difference. I'm going to get rid of my formulas now that I have used them. And I have merely the arithmetic to do now. So I have 4 factorial over, this is 1 factorial, and 1 factorial is just 1, so this is 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 over 1 factorial, which is 1. So this is 4 times 3 is 12 times 2 is 24. Well, if I went through and counted these, or just looked at them, I would notice that there are indeed 24 different permutations. Doing the calculations here, I have 4 factorial over 3 factorial, 1 factorial. I'm going to put little dicky doos on that so we can tell the difference. This is 4 times 3 factorial over 3 factorial. And 1 factorial is just 1, so I'm going to go ahead and stop looking at him. I can cancel this, and I only have 4 as my answer. So I have four permutations, and I have 24 permutations and four combinations. And sure enough, where's my little bitty? Here's my four guys versus this amazingly huge thing over here. That was the 24. So that's the subtle difference in the actual calculations, and the previous video showed how we arrived at these different types of writing out of the letters.